it's me, Nimsoni. Welcome to another VR video. Uh, today, well, yesterday I was watching a hot films video. Uh, one of the sort of older ones, just for fun of it. I like to watch a lot of YouTube. And uh, they were playing a game called Snow, which is a skiing game, uh, but also has a bit of snowboarding, I believe. Um, and I thought, you know what, I want to do some skiing. I've never been skiing in real life. I fear that if I did go skiing, I'll probably end up killing myself because uh, I am a bit of an adrenaline junkie when I get into adrenaline. So I'll do the cra craziest thing first time on slopes and probably break every bone in my body. Um, so I decided let's do some VR skiing. I couldn't find any good VR skiing games uh, that use proper skiing physics. There was one that I saw which didn't actually use proper skiing physics. It was just one of those sort of infinite runner, um, lean a bit to the left, lean a bit to the right to move. Uh, but uh, the only other one was snow itself and that doesn't use actual VR controls as far as I as far as I know. So what I decided to do was literally make one. And this was done literally in a day because like I say I pretty much started it end of yesterday and it uses some actual proper physics. So uh, well to a certain extent it uses some logical physics. Ooh, I'm going a bit too much. Ah, land it. Land it. Ah, there we go. Okay so literally about three or four um, preset built blocks of uh, of this uh, sort of map uh, when your sticks skiing sticks skiing poles whatever they're called touch the ground based on where they touch is uh, sort of controls your controls your friction on them and so they allow you to turn or uh, slow down or speed up as well and uh, let's just have a very quick look and of course you can sort of apply some acceleration on the way up Let's turn back in and go through this little cave here. I think they're turning a little bit quicker than I thought. I just increased the speed just now on the turning and it's a bit its a bit too much. But yeah. And that's pretty much all I was doing. It's literally a one day project this. Uh, done really quickly. Let's just get, get up in the air. Ooh, and there's another cave in front of me. I'm going to go to the left this time. Ooh, too much, too much, too much, too much, too much. <sighs> yeah, you probably wouldn't be able to ski up slopes in reality, but uh, this was done in a day, <laughs> just for fun. So yeah, this is one of the blocks. Uh, that one there in front of us is another sort of kind of valley type thing with the more larger rocks that you can sort of follow a pathway through. These trees were just taken from the asset store. The textures were just found on the net. Pretty simple stuff. A little bit of clever background work there. Ooh, just over the tree. Ooh. And that's about it really. This was just a, a very quick video, very quick build of a game. If you guys want to try and play or, so, or something like that, just let us know. Um, I'll probably just make a little bit of polish and just, just build it up. It's, it's pretty much an infinite snowing game, a skiing game even. Ooh, this is a nice valley. Oh, right into a tree. Oh, that was just close, that. It's a little bit of tree dodging here. Slalom. Yeeha. A quick spin and land it. There's no ragdoll or falling off your skis or, or even proper crashing or anything. It's literally just this. Let's try a double. I made it. Oh, I'm falling. I'm falling. Eep. There we go. It's literally just this. <laughs> it's only because I hadn't made a video for about a week or a little while. And uh, I've been spending most of my time working on Tubby Supercat right now, which now has proper swimming and uh, has a lot of upgrades to the world as well. Uh, you'll probably see that if you've uh, been focusing, uh, seeing my Twitter feed, or if you join the Discord, of course. Uh, be sure to join the Discord if you like uh, if you like my stuff, if you want to subscribe uh, to the work as well, because you'll see more on... Ooh, you'll see more on the Discord. I tend to post a lot on there, on the showcase. Uh, you also get to talk to a lot of other people as well on there. Uh, you see a lot of work on there from other people. Uh, the showcase section has some pretty cool stuff on there, and that, that's not made by me. You'll get to see a lot of 
uh, other developers. Not just Unity as well, you can just talk in Unity, Unreal, whatever you do, whatever you want to make. Let's try and jump off this rock here. It was sort of positioned so that you could. Oh, oh, I'm turning a bit too much. Yes, yeah, skiing up rocks, that definitely works in real, real life. And land it. Ooh. And uh, that's pretty much all for this video, really. That's, uh, that's all it was. It's just this. Let's go up to this left side of the valley. And uh, end the video and let me go eat some dinner. <laughs> yeah, just a quick video this. I am quite tired actually. It's really hot in here. Which is funny because I'm playing a sort of skiing game. Uh, yeah, you can see I just smash right into the rock at like 300 miles per hour. Doesn't matter. I'm perfectly fine. Let's do triple spin. Two, three. I landed backwards. Uh oh, that's a problem. And we flipped it and we made it. Yeah, boy. Anyways, that's that. That's the whole of this video. Um, thanks very much for watching. You know, subscribe, like, whatever. Join the Discord. That's probably the most fun part. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.